Now that we've seen Sumak and his abilities, let's take a look at the next thinker, Garam. At first glance, Garam seems much more powerful than Sumak, although it can be difficult to start with Garam. Let's see why. Garam is the fastest thinker by far, which can be a great advantage. Let's head into the flatlands. Welcome to the flatlands. Well, let's get started. First of all, Garam only starts with three braves instead of the usual four, but has two warriors on his side. Garam's special ability is sharpened axes, which doubles your brave's damage, which could be a great use of defense. Let's start with a house. a few houses down, but with only three braves, the start can be deceivingly difficult. Garam is supposed to focus the player around combat and relationships. Let's see how. Let's take a look at the festivals. The challenge objective often requires fabric, but in this case, two of our festivals also do as well. The Skyland Festival requires quite a bit of fabric, but helps you improve your relationship with your neighbors. Let's check it out. By sending the warriors to the Thinker, they'll protect him as he travels the desert. Let's see if we can find some technology. Taking technology nearby another town can often land you in trouble. It's good to have protection in these cases. Hmm. Fabric provided should give you a hand when building festivals, although having a source of fabric may still be necessary. With fabric, you should more easy, easily be able to build demands and trade tables to initiate negotiations. However, the Skyland Festival will improve relations with all your neighbors. Campfire, you can see your relationship statuses. Things are getting better. <laughs> However, if things don't go well, sharpened axes will help with double damage and allow us to defend from raids more easily. With just braves. The log bonfire festival is expensive to build as it costs a lot of logs, but it'll produce reeds in the surrounding area. An easy way to get more logs is through the bannered grove, another one of Garam's festivals. This festival will grow more logs depending on how many banners are placed nearby. The fewer the banners, the less logs. If we can get four, that's pretty good. That's a good amount of reeds. See how the logs grow. That's a good.
good amount of logs. That'll keep us going for a long while. Having braves with sharpened axes can give us an advantage during certain mission objectives. Like this rescue objective where we have to break the tinker out of the cage. checking out Garam with me. Although his start may be a little bit tricky, once you get used to it, he could become your favorite. 